established in September 1990, Fatima Senior Secondary School was the first highest learning institution in Foni. The school seeks to improve the learning conditions of students, instill discipline and self-confidence, empowerment and provide learning opportunities and skills, thus enabling them to better handle the challenges of life. Ibrahim Jaju, an interim committee member of the class of 2008, said that the school is known for discipline and hard work. Jaju called on the ex-students of Fatima to give back to the school considering its present condition. Collectively, like the principal said, we can be able to move mountains. We had a lot of constraints, but equally we had a lot of ex-students. A lot of badges has passed through. And I think if we share the constraints, come one day, it is going to be history. So I want to use this medium to implore the entire um, ex-students to look back to Fatima and do what the 208 badge is doing, or in fact do more than what they have been doing. Philip Bass, the principal and an ex-student of Fatima, recalled when the school started with two classes of Form 1 and a total of 90 students. He recalled that the first two batches of graduates from the school were the GCE O-level classes, which were finally phased out in June 1996. Mr. Bass explained that despite its numerous achievement and impact, the school is faced with overwhelming constraints that could retard its academic excellence. He said there is need for the establishment of a staff quarters, painting of the whole school. Bass also emphasized that the roofing of some of the buildings need replacement because students are forced to vacate the classrooms when it rains. Computers for our computer lab is another big constraint. Uh, we will love our students by the time they graduate at Fatima Senior Secondary can go straight to work and use computers conveniently. This is our, our, our target. We also want to equip the library with modern and relevant textbooks. Um, the library has harbored very, very old books which are very irrelevant. I wish we open it today, we, we, you see books like, uh, that talks about the history, of, the history of America, we don't need that. We need modern textbooks that can serve the purpose. We also want to equip the technical and the wood workshop with the necessary tools. The principal adds that despite their huge efforts and achievements, their progress is being held back by lack of support. The science lab needs to be refurbished with reagents and apparatus to accommodate the conduct of practicals. We don't want a situation where we only prepare our students for exams. We want uh, practicals to be, to be an ongoing thing where our students are prepared right from grade 10 before they even reach grade 12. Furniture for the hall where we conduct our exams is also a big constraint. You will realize that we frequently move furniture from classrooms to the hall and from the hall back. This is also what is causing the problems of uh, damages. With the objective to inspire and give back to its school, Fatima class of 2008 presented dozens of corrugated iron seats to the school as a start. The school's motto, Lux Mundi, means light of the world in Latin. If no action is taken, light of the world may soon begin to dim. For QTV News, I am Amadou Oba.